There he goes! There he goes! Tally ho! <laughs> Welcome back, Noodles. Welcome back. It is time to continue our Denmark campaign. So... I hope you guys have been enjoying the episodes. I'm really hoping with this new strategy that I thought of the other night that I'll be able to um, pretty much get this done in the next several turns, I'm hoping. So here's what I thought for a strategy, okay? So right as of right now, I wish I could like zoom out and do tactical maps. I'm so spoiled by those now. <laughs> but we'll continue to, all, to get our interior leveled up to where they're big cities they're producing all that stuff we'll keep breaking in the financials that way we are going to make an army um since we did take no Novogrod, novgorod um we are going to try and broker some peace so i'm actually going to send this diplomat while i'm thinking about it out towards the next russian city so that way they are, we can broker a peace deal with them. We might be able to tell them to bugger off one of those. Uh, this episode, hopefully, if not this, the next episode, we are going to take Kiev and that is going to be ours. So we'll take Kiev, and then the next look will be up here at Smolensk, <laughs> Smolensk, 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 that's the word. Smolensk. We'll go and look at Smolensk if we can't broker a peace deal with them. If we can broker peace, we'll leave them alone and we'll station an army here in, Vilna in Vilnius. Or Vilnius. Vilnius. We'll station an army there to pretty much just guard this sector as we march our armies this way to help conquer the western side of Europe and into Italy itself. So that is the kind of the goal right now. So far, I have been bringing this troop here to reinforce my boy here. These two are going to go to war with Milan. We are going to take Venice. We are going to then jump in to take Bologna. Then we're going to jump up and take out Bern. And what's this? Milan itself. And Genoa. So we're going to try and go like ping pong bong ding dong. Like that. <laughs> And if I can do it properly, we should be fine. Now, this army here is what's yes, coming boy. up and reinforcing our boys here in the yeah. north. Uh, we had several escapades against the Scottish rebels here, which we need to go and help them out a little bit more. I need to try and conquer those rebels. Um, looking back at that video, too, and that strategy that I tried to pull, I would have just been better off making them line up you know, and having the cavalry attack full charge that way instead of in the Skiltrum positions. But I was trying something. It didn't really work like I thought it would. Oh, well. <laughs> we do have a rebellion army right here that we're going to need to take a look at. And then we've got our army right here getting ready to take Caravoyan or Caravon. Caravon, yes, Caravon, right? We're going to take that and then we're going to ship them over to Dublin. So I got to get a boat actually over here so we're gonna sail the boats that way so we can get them over there after we take that in dublin we're going to march or ship the army back over this army should possibly be able to come over here and take this out to be quite honest so we do have a bunch of english priests here which i'm not worried about because we share the same religion so Anyway, that is kind of the strategy because the big thing is to get the rest of the numbered provinces that we need because we only control 40 or 25. We need 20 more to get to our 45 region and we have 71 turns remaining. The other thing too is we got to get armies ready to go to Jerusalem as well. So we're going to need to possibly make a, a couple navies and we're just going to ship them out. And my goal also is to not be at war with anybody in this region. So that way the Venetians or anything like that don't come and try and kill me while I'm out in the water. Because that's going to really suck. So that's the other reason too that we need to try and 
knock out Milan as best as possible. Oh, I forgot about Marseille over here. Uh, or Marseille? Marseille? Anyway, Southern France. <laughs> We're going to have to go and take that out too. So, that is kind of the deal right now. How may I say? My Cardinal, I can kind of move him down here. As you wish. With that being said, I think that's pretty much all. What is he doing? He's not trading anything, so let's bring that. There we go. And then over here... I don't have any agents, so I'm trying to get him into there, but I'm pretty sure these are these guys are going to try and siege it, maybe? So we'll see what happens. Uh, yeah. That's pretty much the game plan. Uh, we're still allied with Budapest, or with Hungary, so Hungary should be fine. I'm just really hoping... Actually, I'm going to start marching him this way, because I want to see what the rest of Italy looks like. So I'm going to bring my spy this way. And then this spy. I think we're fine here. I don't think we have to worry too much about them. We'll march them out this way so we can see what they look like here in Smolznik. And that will end the turn. Rioting in Novorod. Of course. It's always rioting when we take over places. Cardinal was promoted. And let's see. So Poland is now at war with Sicily. <laughs> Venice has declared war on us. What did I say? That is so lame. All right. That's fine. Uh, yeah. Okay. I don't remember exactly what I've done. So a noble life ends. A merchant died. Oh, no. That's okay. Because we can get another one going. Down here at the Amber. And then there, we need one for that as well. So we're going to recruit another merchant. I don't care about the rest. Breslau is ready to upgrade. We're going to go ahead and do that. Tunis of uh, Poland has joined on that one. We are the most advanced faction. We're making some good money. Betrayed by Hungary? What? So these self-serving scum have at last proven that they may they're horrorless traitors. Council demands that they must pay for the treachery. What happened? Okay, so I take it we're not allies anymore? Oh, we're at war with the Hungarians? Really? Yes, Lord. Ah, oh, that puts a damper in some things. Why is it always the AI f trickery and shit that they always try to do with me here? <laughs> I just explained a plan, and now that plan is almost null and void at the moment. What in the heck? All right, that's fine. I will defeat you honorably, my worthy foe. So God we got a that. Battle. That's our boy. No, your enemy. It is me. The Hungarians, like that's the thing. I don't know if these guys are going to us or are they going to the Crusade because they're a Crusader army. So they might not come to war. I thought Hungary broke the alliance with them, not us. Oh, I didn't read that properly. Crap. Okay. New plan. <laughs> so we are not going to go to war with Milan now. We're going to start. We're going to have to march our troops back up here to go after the Hungarians. So I'm going to march them this way. We move onward tomorrow. We're gonna take this army and march down. March. We go no further this day, my lord. Uh, let's see. Got some troops I could recruit here in Innsbruck, so we're going to just get a bunch of swordsmen together. Rally the troops, rally! Going to get together a bunch of crossbowmen. In Nuremberg, because I'm not sure exactly where they might strike. We'll get some war clerics and a crossbowman there. Frankfurt. Get some crossbowmen there. Crossbowmen everywhere. We'll get that. And a spear. Vienna. 
What are they? Okay. So, yeah, okay. Crap, I was not expecting that. We've got another Hungarian force right here as well. Not very strong, though, so... The Bavisi Crossbow Militia, that, that's something to look at, but everyone else should be good. Yes, Lord. Um, I'm also going yeah. to take this army. Crap, not that. Uh, recruit. Get a bunch of mercs together. And let's see. So somebody died over here. At least it looked that way. No let's see, an English diplomat. All right, we're going to send him after this guy. Who defies the Lord? Divine man. Orders my Lord. Let's get him over to... Bruges. Yes. Surrounding and besieging the settlement. Same thing there and that. The siege is ongoing, my Lord. Yes. An honor to serve, my Lord. Okay, so we replaced it with these guys instead. Okay, I got it. That's fine. We can do that. Because that because this army isn't going to be great. So we'll save them up. Let them keep recruiting. We have the other army there for help. Let's see, France we're neutral with, even though we're crossing through their lands. So sorry, I will leave in a minute. Alright, here. Alright, hold on. Before I do all that, because I'm like overthinking it right now. Yes, Lord. Booyah. Yes, Lord. Confronting the enemy. Besieging settlement. We'll do that. That should now, be enough. Boo <laughs> That's gonna be a fun siege. Let's see, let's get some Welsh long bowmen, some of these guys, and one of them. We'll fill out the army there, that'll work. All right, this army. Shall be Do I not have any like agents here? Or we'll recruit a priest. Ooh. Okay, that's like a pikeman. Let's get one of them. I want to see how they look. Okay, that's all our recruitment slots. And we'll do a castle library as well since we can and let's take a look up north that one's almost done these guys are pretty good hi ah, you captain eric let's join this army combining troops trying to think how i want to do this <laughs> I continue to march these guys down or sail them down. Got to be very careful now as to what we do. Yes, my lord. To board the Take out them boats. My lord, we are victorious as ordered. We got another you bad priest up here. Victorious. Not good. Ah. And dead. <laughs> Okay, he's gone. And let's see. Helsinki, we need to get ready. Honestly, we could go ahead and turn that into a town. We don't need that to be a castle anymore. Combine them. Yes. Okay, cool. All right, everybody seems pretty decent as far as what we can do for the moment. Can retrain them. Novgorod is pissed. We're going to go low tax rate and we're going to put a church in. Oh, wait, we're going to repair that first. Cannon maker tavern. Okay, we don't really need the catapults. I don't use them anymore. <laughs> and then yes. everybody else. Well, you can go there. 
they're gonna retrain in armor, so they're they're not exactly gonna be an army anymore. We'll continue to march him down this way. Tomorrow's journey awaits. An order. Oh no! To negotiate the truce. We will not rest until you relent hmm. one way or another. This army should be enough to go against this guy. So I'm going to go ahead and march him down. I'm going to move the prince back. Get marching. Oh, this is going to be fun. <laughs> oh, how the dice have turned forever not in our favor. Like I said, though, I don't know if these armies if the crusader armies are actually coming to us or if they're going to tunis or whatever which i mean there's already crusade but where tunis where the heck is tunis at i forget toulouse bordeaux angers dijon like it's not us I can't remember where Tunis is. <laughs> My geography is bad. That's why I was way off because it's in freaking Africa. Duh. <laughs> Sorry. So they're they're at war there. So okay. But like I said, I don't know. These armies could very well siege one of my areas in the next turn. So we're gonna try and get these guys together as quick as possible. Um, we do have some of the boys here doing their thing yes. he's leading that army I'm that I'm army so yes, we do have one general per army now for the most you part i was doing a two general per Order army like this Lord. one i still kind of will for some stuff because they just work as good heavy cavalry but we do want them to get experience so gotta look at that dear. all right i think that'll do it for this okay so the army the Hungarian army, I don't see it anymore. Unless I'm blind. So what I'm going to do, we got a Hungarian di diplomat here. I'm actually going to get a diplomat going. I'm going to get two. And see if I can go and broker peace with the Hungarians. Like, I'll pay them off. I don't care. Uh... The Holy Roman Empire are now at war with Milan. Okay. And they've broken their alliances with all those guys. They're done. More construction, which right now I'm not really looking at it too much. Okay, a spy died and that spy died. Okay, that's fine. We had a agent in Innsbruck from Milan. Now they have broken a peace deal with us, so I don't know how that's going to go. All right, so it does look, there it is. So they're in the middle here now. I don't know what that means for us though, but I want to continue this army north because they're going to start marching through and taking out the English areas. That's kind of their goal. Uh, This army should be good to get this now. Victory! Though I would have liked lesser um, casualties, it's okay. Sack settlement because, you know, we need to show them what's what. <laughs> we'll put in a town hall and then... Oh, wait. Repair first. Those things. Then put in a town hall. Okay, so that's done. Yes. This one we're probably going to have to fight manually. All right. Let's bring you close. We're going to get these guys to march on to England. On to London. One, two, three. One, two, three. Orders, my king. Move out. Those are make good wall breachers, if anything. And then we'll continue with some Norse archers and a crossbowman. No. Axeman. Okay, that'll work out for that army. There's that rebel army again. 
I will only address you in... Aha! Iverness. Town Hall. We'll go ahead and get that going. Recruitment-wise... Can't do anything just yet, but we'll go ahead and recruit a priest here just for the heck of it. Alright, so that one is something we're going to have to pay attention to. Okay, there is an English ship up this way, so we just got to kind of look out for them. So Venice is no longer at least a target for right now. We are going to need to pay attention to that soon, though. Because we need to get some kind of port here in the in the Mediterranean area. So if we can get it off the coast here, that'll give us access to just come boop and do it. Because if not, I'm going to have to make an army up here, put them on a boat, and sail them all around this way just to get over to where we need to go. And that's just going to be way too many turns. So if we can cut it off here, we'll do that. Honestly, I don't really care if we piss off all the other nations at this point because we are pretty big. And I think we'll do more good than harm pissing them off. So it's not yes. that big a deal to me. All right, let's go ahead and march this guy this way. Oh, wait, I want him to go there. Continue him towards the Russians to possibly broker a peace deal with them. We do have some assassins, so I want to go ahead and grab these guys and get them out. So militia troops can stay. Soldier troops, we're going to go ahead and get them out of 5,000. Put in a growth morning, built. Because that usually works. And let's see, let's put in a church. Retrain those guys. Train up another militia unit just to see if we can withhold I'm it. Honored to serve, my lord. And then we'll go ahead and march this guy down here yes. too. I want to get them away from the assassins. I don't want to deal with assassins right now. Because that's going to suck. And I really don't need my generals dying. Alright. The other thing was that Polish Crusader army coming this way. So Krakow, we need to bolster its defenses. Let's go ahead and grab a couple of those guys and get them ready. Krakow is pretty pissed too. We'll get them a tavern. That way they have some good quality mead and beer for my boys. I am not here. I will defeat you honorably. My orders, my We're going to continue to march on to yes, Lord. Confronting my the area enemy. here. Yes. Surrounding We're going to grab some ladders and maintain the, the siege. siege is ongoing, my lord. And let's see. I, am neither I don't like you being in my much. lands. Only my lord we shall not relent. I'm going to put Never. them up in front here just to kind of deter. We're going to see what they do. Because if they decide to attack us, because honestly, Milan does that. They always do that kind of crap. So we'll see how that goes. All right. Yeah, I forgot to have Lars here. Oh, ha, 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 ha. Forgot about that. Catapult would be fine. But again, I never really use these because I feel like they're not that great. <laughs> All right. Let's get another swordsman, another axeman, and we'll start to get a couple of Norse archers in his army. We're going to start fletching out an army for him. Because honestly, I'm these troops serve, were pretty much donezos. Let's see. We can go ahead and march these guys out. We put an honor to serve, my lord. you boys yes. in. Of course. Put that on a growth build. Yes. Merge together my everyone we can. My lord. Retrain who we can. Can't recruit anybody just yet, which is fine. An honor to uh, serve, we'll take lord. these guys... Yes. Out and put them into this area. Honor to serve, my Men, march. I will make and then we'll combine an to these two together to make one With army. Honor. And that. God's that'll sake. do it, dog. Oh, no! May God expose. How may I serve? On my way. Crap. As you wish. Stop blocking my people. Until morning, my lord. 
We lost a priest. That's not good. Oh no, we found a witch. All right. So as far as our strategy in the south now, because now we're having... Oh, this sucks because I'm having to like eat my turns. Um, Yeah, we're just going to keep it as is. We'll take Vienna. More than likely, they'll broker a peace deal after we ca capture that. So I'm not too worried about it. But I also don't want to say that... Uh, you know, I don't want to sound too... Whatchamacallit. <laughs> Let's see. All right. Too prideful. Something All right. Will make Let's send our king in. Leave your mercy behind. All right. Hopefully this works. The way I've got it set up, we got the front line there with the artillery up front for right now. I'm going to try and march them back as quick as possible. We've got pretty much everybody getting in line up here on the hill. So I'm hoping that we have enough uh aim and stuff to be able to do what i want to do so we do have some archers here that i'm hoping that i can kind of kill a little bit so we're just trying to get these guys out and about get them boys our men are winning the battle if we continue like this, we will smash the enemy. All right, we're going to have to back them up. I didn't even get to really use them. Oh, shit. Oh, I hate it when that happens. I forget that they don't have that. All right, can we not fire right now? Oh gosh. All right, take a look at our other flank here. These Crusader Knights, yeah, that's what I was worried about here. All right, we're gonna pop on skirmish mode for these guys. Same here. All right, we're gonna get crossbowmen over there. They're hitting our back line. We're going to get the Axemen to go into them. Merchants got to, or the mercenaries got to make do on what we get them. You know what I mean? They, we got to, we got to get them to earn their money. <laughs> All right. I actually don't know how this is going to fare. So I'm going to shoot this. The enemy are badly actually, they have lost half their men. don't fire. Don't fire. See if we can bring these guys up. All right, these are our Huskarls. All right, these are human or archers. Let our Huskarls do some of the dirty work there. Our men are winning the battle. If we continue like this, we will smash the enemy. Uh oh. Don't 
Y'all really think you could do that? Nah. Yeah, the cavalry, that's the problem here. No, you guys stay in line. I don't know why when I try to select something, it doesn't want to work ever. Let's pick up those rockets. Where are you guys at? All right, let's uh, yeah, not have you guys do that. Let's bring you guys back up, please. Because we got the others, which is the Ballastays, to go after. So we're going to send our Huskarls after those guys. Enemy king is there we go. A worthy enemy. Oh, no perfect. For that. Yeah, I didn't go exactly like I was hoping. I was hoping we'd get a little bit more, but I forgot that they have they were had a lot of cavalry. So, yeah, the rockets probably weren't the best idea for that. But we can go ahead and get them reset up. I don't see anybody on our flank as bad as... I thought at least get them after those guys all right we'll send our boys after them because now they're coming in with the ballastays and then these peasants so Honestly, we should be able to realign here. Look how our cowardly Boy, our swordsman run. really did take a hit. Alright, we're going to go after those town militia. You can go after them. You can go after them. And then we'll go after those guys. Our general and our prince, because this is their army. They're going to come this way. And it's just going to be a cavalry charge. Because honestly, I think everybody else is pretty much donezos for now. Ugh. So much dead. Most of it mine. <laughs> Past general Pasta did not think that through good enough. <laughs> Get them to fire on those guys. Got the ballastays. Our men have captured the enemy general. The enemy there goes another one. Blooded. They have lost half their men. Onward to the next one. I'll just let them do it. <laughs> that works. King Bruce live. Oh, this is my king's army. Never mind. I thought this was the prince's army. No, the prince we were bringing back to the castle. That's right. The king wins again against King Tobias the Watcher. Again, we took a little more casualties than I would have liked there, but that's okay. Um. Yes, we can. Nah. <laughs> you fight against our king, you die. <laughs> I've given you chances. You constantly laugh at me. Once we breach the walls, they are finished. Dunzos. Keeve is mine. <laughs> they deserve nothing less than death. They are broken. And we will sack them. Because that's what I like to do, because it's fun. <laughs> All right, low tax rates. We need to repair everything. Oh, no. All right, we can repair the council chambers is more important. And then we can retrain once we get everything back up. So 
We'll let our guys chill there for the turn. Time to march him up here to see if we can broker a deal. If not, we're going to have to march up there to kick their butts. Okay, so I'm going to go ahead and park him. How old is Prince Halder? 54. 54, wonderful years. See, I have a Serpentine Cannon here too, so... I'm going to give them another one of those and another one of those. And one, two, three, four, four archers ought to do it. Four archers. The rest are going to be swordsmen and all that stuff. So, all right, cool. Let's see. What else? What else can we do? Yes. Oh, yeah. Pretty much, now we're going to do yes, this Lord. one. Marching to battle with pride, Lord. They have the better troops, technically. So, but the thing is, is that hopefully we can break into the walls and assault them better. So we'll see what happens. Hopefully, things work out. Okay, Doki Artichoke. I did leave the battle timer on for this one. Um, figured I'd I'd role play it. You know what I mean? <laughs> Got the idea for one of my subscribers, so I wanted to put that in play for this one just to kind of counteract it. We don't have anything to break the walls down though, so it's do or die for these guys. Assault the walls. Go, my boys. Go. Put them in a loose formation. And we're going to bring them forward. To about here, maybe. Same with our other boys. It is raining, so it hopefully will make this not as easy to catch on fire. So if we can get in through the gate, I can bring in the knights and have them storm it. The ladders are now in place. Walls are no match for the fury of the north. All right, so all of my Norse archers, all of my those guys. Go, boys, go! I want to see what happens here. The towers are devastating, man. That's that's the thing. Just feels like we're not even hitting the mark, really. But we got to hope that these guys being heavily armored, they'll be good enough to go against them. All right, we can go ahead and maybe be able to get them. Oh no, it broke. Son of a bitch. Well, I doubt it, but I can try and see if I can get them up over here. Damn. <laughs> That's usually why I recruit too, just in case. But I mean, if there's if this is in the way, it's it blocks like the whole path. So it just ends up not working out for us very well, like I would hope. All right, let's see if we can get some of the English kerns or the Irish kerns, I mean, up here. And then same here, we're trying to get some of them. Irish kerns. 
I was really hoping to break in through here and get and grab that gate so I could get the knights in and then they would be able to go and mess these guys up at least a little bit. Ugh. Storm the walls! Uh, we might not be prepared enough for this. <laughs> That's okay. If we do lose, I'll be able to bring them in in the next army. All right. Let's see if I can bring these guys over here. Come on, guys. Go that way. I gotta capture the gate. Gotta capture the gate. Our soldiers have proved their worth today. The enemy's walls belong to us. Now. Go, go, go! Everyone inside. <laughs> Everyone inside. No! Ah. Oh. Never mind. Never mind. Retreat. <laughs> Come back. <laughs> the battle is very much in our favor. If we No, it's not. Oh. Victory will be ours. Oh. Everybody back inside. Go. No! Damn it! Open back up! Open back up! Oh, I thought I had it. Whoa, what are the archers doing? Whoa, 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 whoa! Whoa! What are y'all doing, fools? No. <laughs> like, I was hoping. Oh, yeah, we're so screwed over here. Just kind of wasting shots over here. Let me see if I can bring them back this way. That's the problem is trying to fight it with the wall or with the towers and stuff. Those towers kill you every time. I don't understand why these guys. Let's back them up just a bit more. Oh my gosh, they are like stacked over here. No, boys. Get them, boys. Get them. Let's see if I can get these kerns up on the other side. Maybe, maybe not. We'll see. How are the archers doing over here? They got a few bits.
Y'all aren't even firing, man. Here, just come up here. If you're gonna die, at least die in a fight. <laughs> All right, the buh, 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 buh. All right, I want to try and use the Welsh longbowmen over here. I might be able to get the ones that are over the wall. Might. All right. It looks like I might be able to do this. Let's see if I can bring them up. Boy, if this does work, this is going to be funny as heck. I forgot about them. Shoot. That might have been helpful. <laughs> Alright, we're going to let them chill because, yeah. Oh, the Irish Kerns. It didn't work. Very much in our favor. If we remain true and steadfast, victory will be ours. Yeah, so you say, Mr. Man. So you say. Again, if I can get the archers over here to capture the gate, I'm sure we could do it. But I've got to get them there. Okay. Run in, my boys. Please, oh, please run in. Men have reached the walls with their ladders. Yes. There we go. I'm going to see if I can pelt the crap out of them. See, they're coming down now, but the walls aren't being manned, so they shouldn't shoot at us. The battle is very much in our favor. If we remain true and steadfast, victory will be ours. Try and see if I can finagle this. Cause this is kind of the sucky part now. Get him.
To be honest though, them with halberds probably isn't the best to go after them that way. So let's get the these guys down. Oh no, the mercenaries. You dicks. <laughs> Shit, I know. I don't think I can bring them in, but I'm going to try. Try and back them up. You cowards. The enemy are badly bloodied. They have lost half their men. All right, I got one of them out. I'm going to let them chill there for a second. Let's try and bring everybody in. Same here. We'll bring these guys in as well. Got to get that, though. There we go. It's going to be a group effort, guys. Group effort. Oh, I wish pathfinding was way better than it is. Get him, boys! If we continue like this, we will smash the enemy. All right, take him out. Oh, pathfinding. <laughs> so now they're getting shot. Okay, there we go. Let's bring you back. Bring you back. Oh, bring the war clerics back. Oof. Do to do to do to do to do to do. Spearman, go! Alright, bring the king back. Or not the king, but our general here. If I can get these spearmen in, they should be able to take care of a lot of these horsemen. You whores! <laughs> Oh, that's so lame. Alright, it's probably because they're exhausted. That's probably what it is. So let's try and get the Irish Kerns. We'll put them in a tight formation. And let's see if I can get these guys inside. These guys are good, right? Yeah, let's send these guys in. Go! 
Go, boys, go! With all our brothers sacrificed, we should be able to win this now. Maybe. Try and get everybody down. Where are they fighting? That made no sense. Go, go! <laughs> Oh, you're not getting any money, you mercenaries. Alright, let's see if we can not waste any more time here. I'm just worried about a rear charge from these bodyguard units. But anything will be good for now. We need to get these guys going. Alright, like I said, tight formation... See if we can get rid of these knights. All right, that booped him out a bit. Alright, that got rid of them. Oh, we might actually win this. Might be in a key word here. You're a dumb spare man, I don't like you anymore. All right, we just got to hope that these guys can kill the general, hopefully. There he is. Kill that son of a bitch. Because them being in the middle, there's no point in throwing any troops in the middle here. We can let whoever fight, and that's fine. We'll march these guys up so they can join. Let's see, who else do we have? Oh, I didn't even notice. Uh, let's see if I can bring these guys into the fray and then same with you guys. Y'all go after them. Like the thing is, is I know the tree probably plays a little bit of an issue here. Let's see if I can get them closer. 
Might be playing with fire here doing this, but I'm going to try. Because I want to be able to at least have good clear way to charge. Like, I don't like... Like, they're almost in a block. I don't like that. And I'm trying to get him away from the tree too, so. Let's see, we speed it up a bit. Ah! Alright. Everyone, go, go, go! I forgot they still have dismounted feudal knights. Actually, we probably could go still from with them now, and that might work out. Oh, okay, that's the Bill Knights that were there. Okay, got it. I'm gonna march them in, and then these Norse archers, tight formation. And we can go ahead and bring them in up as well. Oh, my, my Huskarls. <laughs> Alright, let's bring them back. Turn off fire at will. Not exactly a great charge, but, you know. Oh, that'll be perfect. Yes, attack them. Our men are winning the battle. If we continue like this, we will smash the enemy. Trying to get a couple of charges in, but... Not too good here. <laughs> All right, let's bring them back. We'll go after the town militia with these guys. Everybody is exhausted. This is crazy. Yeah, it's not going to give them the best, but it'll do. All right, back up. Because once they get in the middle, they're going to be invincible. So we don't want that.
We've got to play to our strength right now. Which at the moment is just trying not to die. <laughs> little by little, if I can get these guys out, then we should be good. If we remain true and steadfast, victory will be ours. It's okay, the more they go in and out, I mean, the better we're going to have the chances of beating them, so. I'm trying to save the Kerns, though, for when we get the chance to actually fight them. I wish I had some more of the longbow shots, but oh well. Because if not, I'd have had them back here just wailing in on them, but we don't get that right now, so. Oh well. All right, we got Town Militia. These guys are holding their form, which is great. Oh, man. Oh, this is really like nail biting to the wire right now. Again, things might have been a little bit different had we had I been able to get the the walls taken out or the gate taken out, but that's okay. All right, I'm gonna get. Against these feudal knights. The quicker I can get rid of these guys, the quicker these dudes are gonna run in, the general bodyguard. And then I'll be able to kind of tag them with one of these guys while these while my Kerns help them. That's kind of the goal with them. Alright, back them out, back them out. I'm going to keep the guard mode off because I want them to just attack right now. Everybody else is kind of chilling and doing their thing, so. So we got a spear unit. We still got a town militia. And then the general's bodyguard. So the... Okay, cool. So the ones I thought, they're dead. The feudal knights. All right, now we can just kind of attack against them. Again, we pin them down, we'll be fine. There's the general. My king will come for you. Or not my king, my general! <laughs> it would be cool if the king was in England, but he's not. He's out in Poland, fighting in Russia, Serbia area. Okay, back out again. We get another charge off if we can. Get these guys to hold them in place. Meanwhile, wonder if I can get these guys over here. If we continue like this, we will smash the enemy. General's bodyguard fighting to the death. 
gonna send in our Norse swordsman. There he goes! There he goes! Tally ho! <laughs> and you're dead. Ha! I pulled that one out of my butt. And take out the final guys here. What kind of charge was that, guys? Come on. Hello, hello. There's our boy. Our general right there. And at great cost, the castle is ours. <laughs> oh my gosh. That was crazy. Oh man, we lost 1,286 men. A lot of them mercenaries though, so I'm not too bad worried about that. But that's okay. We have Nottingham. We can, we'll get another army together soon. But for them to slaughter that many, whew, that's a lot. Bodyguard, 68. Norse War Cleric's got 142, so that's pretty nice. Well, say la vie. And with that, Karen of Arn is ours. And yeah, we're gonna sack it. I feel like when we just occupy it, a lot of the times things don't work out the way I wish them to, so. All right, cool. Not too bad. We don't really need a lot of this stuff. We'll get a garrison quarter and then we'll put a chapel in, but, and I guess we could put the leather tanner. Cause we're gonna turn that into a, um, into a town later. So it's no biggie right now. Boy, oh boy, I didn't think that was going to be so crazy, but it was. That was super crazy. Okay. Oh. Now, England, or London, is a town, but it does have some huge stone walls. So, extra wall defenses, iron gate, number of free upkeep, public order, blah, blah, blah. So, that's going to be a fun, but we do have at least the bombards to go and knock the walls down. And then we can, we have enough troops, I think, to be able to go and take it. So, London should be ours within the next turn. This army, however, is definitely going to need a revamp. So, I can't hire any troops at the moment. Oh. Oh, really? Ho, 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 I didn't know it had that. Um, would be kind of fine to keep Nottingham as a castle, since it's a big one. But, nah. I'm going to turn all England into city because it works out better economically that way. Okay, so what I need to do then now, because we can't really re repair troops here. So we're going to just merge everyone we can, which is then going to reduce our upkeep quite a bit. I'm going to keep those because I kind of want two units still. Orders, that one can go away. My you guys one. can go away. Orders, you can go away. Honestly, yes. all the Merc troops Orders, can go away for the most part. I'm going to keep these so we have at least a three set. Um, yes. Yeah, we'll keep My it like own. that for right now. So, in the next bit... Since it is a castle, we can go ahead and retrain a few troops here, which we will do. And then we will... Because uh, we can't... Oh, no, we can train Norse archers. Okay. So we'll basically just... This army will become Norse archers and dismounted huskarls. And a couple of regular huskarls. So we'll see how we can plan that out. All right. So we got a candidate for adoption. Proven commander. I like him. We'll get him. All right. Thieves Guild in Bruges. Don't want it. Riding. The usual. Oh, we did make peace with Venice. So now we have peace with Venice. Which is fine. I'm cool with that. All right. Everybody's good there. <laughs> He's a mean leader. Is that trait decrease? So maybe we lost a dread. I don't know. 
There was an agent in Metz found. Arhus. Oh, yes. We are going to go ahead and upgrade you. And that's the end of the turn. Blah, blah, blah. Okay. So where we're at right now... Again, we need to... Oh. I guess I probably should have just regular occupied it, but... Eh, you know. <laughs> That's okay, though. We'll be able to get that stuff going here soon. Uh, this army, we're going to go ahead and siege out London. Honestly, we sh probably could go ahead and take it, so we shall see. I've got some troops made here. We're going to keep them there for now. Uh, you, I'm going to go ahead and get start recruiting up for you and another priest. For Edinburgh... Looks like we are fine here. I'm actually going to take out Holders, my king. My you two. Leave you guys as a garrison. That should be enough, right? Actually, Holders, take my king. that one out and we're going to grab another crossbow man. So that way it's two, two, and then we have enough for one more crossbow man. Two of each, right? All right, here in York, we can go ahead and take these archers, move them down to Nottingham. Uh, these guys, we can go ahead and take them out. That'll work out. And let's see. I want to build up Oslo, if at all possible, but... I also need to pay attention too. So we are still actually at war with Hungary. So we can't let them. We shall not relent, I would say never. we can't let them go too long without taking some kind of peace. Maybe there's a Hungarian diplomat right there. I must. Let's see. That's an English diplomat. Where's my diplomats? I know I made like one or two. Yes. Let's send out the diplomats. Can I help, my lord? To see if we can talk to any of them. So we we have one here. He might be coming to talk to us. I'm not sure. I'm gonna hold off before actually taking them out because I'm gonna see what they do. All right, small snake. We got the faction leader there. Kiev. Uh, we can go ahead and finish the repairs there. And then we'll make roads. And we will also get a priest from here and a merchant. And I have my diplomat coming up here. So we're going to see if they'll say yay or nay. All right, you guys, cease fire. And we will make a single payment. Uh, we got 10,000. I'll, I'll peace out for 5,000. Let's see if we can go 5,000. Oh, wait, that was a demand. <laughs> Whoopsies. All right, I forgot I can type. Let's do... We'll do 6K. Rejected. We cannot accept this. For real? Man, we've been at war with them for 92 turns. Real? Real talk? Alright, let's do wisdom to share. A ceasefire. Trade rights. I must inform you. Please continue with your ceasefire trade rights. And a regular tribute of 1,000 for 10 turns. Because then that'll be 10,000. That works. Alright, so we don't have to worry about war with Ru with uh, the Russians anymore. So we're cool with them for now. No grod. Doop -a doo We're going to put a priest in here and we'll grab a merchant as well. What do they have here? They have the Master Thief's Guild up here, so we'll keep that. 
Don't really care about the other stuff. All right, we have these guys now, so we're gonna put a town hall there. And let's take a look at our major areas. They're doing good on public order, so I'm not gonna worry about it. We'll get in a militia square, drill square area. And then for you guys, the abbey. All right. With that, honor to serve, my lord. An honor to we serve. should have enough. An honor to serve, my lord. Orders, my king. An honor All right, we're gonna to par serve, park him in Vilnius, An honor and we're gonna to move serve, him towards. Honestly, we are gonna move him towards Smolnik. With honor. Because we're gonna bring this army up with us. My lord. Yes. I'm gonna combine just those guys, the merchants for the or the mercenaries for the most part. And let's see. We're gonna disband you, because we don't need you. Okay. So worse come to worse. Um Yes. The Poles still say no to peace. We will try to sue for peace with them because I want to bring my armies out from over here. I'm already doing that right now with the Prince, so. All right, we're going to start marching him this way towards this city. And I'm also going to bring these guys with him. And what does he need for his army? Got plenty of melee. Let's try and bring these cannons yes. down. Men, march. We move on with orders, my lord. Eh, I figure they're not gonna like it. All right, we're gonna put you back. I will make them fear you. You back. March. An honor to serve my and you in there for now. Actually, you know what? We probably should have. I probably should have actually brought the troops into here. So let's do that. Oh shite! <laughs> Didn't mean to do that, but okay. And. You. Yes, ma'am. Because I want to, I kind of want to build his army up a little bit different, and bring it back up to speed here. All right, we can merge these guys, and then we'll finish that off next turn. Wow, we're almost at turn one sixty. That's crazy for me. All right, Milan looks like they might actually try to attack us at some point, so. I'm going to go back now to my normal plan, and we're just going to send the one army instead, since that army is over here taking Venice. So they'll surrender in nine turns, but they might try to sally out or so. We're just going to hold them for now, because no biggie. Um, we do have this Venetian army walking through our lands, but they're not at war with us at the moment, so we should be fine. Our troops over here, we need to continue to march him towards these lands, but I'm going to bring him up through Man, our land so I'm not march. pissing off the French even more. Go no further this day, my lord. Too late. I'm not worried about right. him too much because we're going to... Your will shall be obeyed. We're going to combine everybody here and I'm going to raise a substantial garrison at this place to make it a lot better. So that's going to be the goal for them. So if they do decide to shall attack, Jimmy. you know, they're just a bunch of horsemen. If I do decide to go and attack them again, then I will. But we'll see. I mean, honestly, I could go out with this guy, but I don't really want to at the moment. I kind of want to save him for against England and stuff. So we're going to move him towards the border here. We'll see what it's like. We'll be able to take Paris, hopefully, in the next go around. All right. So we besieged London. We made peace with Russia. And we're trying to make peace with the Poles, but if they decide not to go with peace, then we're going to have to take them out. We've got our generals marching back to get restocked on army and stuff. 
and troops. We're building up more armies, getting them ready to go. I'm trying to not have too many full stacks at this moment because I don't think we really need them. Maybe one with some trash troops just to have base, a, a basic reinforcement army and then one that's an actual proper army. And then we have um, our boys here in the west starting to go and take the lands. So hopefully in the next turn or so, we'll be able to go and take Ireland with this army. We're going to gather up the troops as best we can here at Cairn until we can turn it into a town. We'll recruit mainly just basic units because honestly, this shouldn't be that hard to go and take. Uh, just making sure agent wise, I don't have any spies out in the area because honestly, I think all my spies are on the mainland. Yes, they are. And that will do it for this episode, Noodles. I appreciate you all for watching. I appreciate you get to the end here. Please leave a like. Remember to subscribe. And I appreciate you just so much. Thank you so much. Bye-bye. Toodaloo.